great round of quizzing, Earl. Yeah. So let's give Charles's fancy effects box a whirl and instant replay some of David and Tyler's great buzzer bashing moments. Hit the rewind, Earl. <laughs> Where are we? And, uh... And what's with these hideous outfits? <gasps> Real fur? Not cool. And so, ten million years ago... Yeah, well, that kind of makes sense. Huh? huh? Look around you. We're in dinosaur times. If he's right, you know what that means, Earl? What? We're done for! We'll be eaten! <gasps> now, come on, what's gonna eat us? Velociraptor? Tyrannosaurus Rexes? Pterodactyl. Or Jarrett. Jarrett? Jarrett the parrot? Not anymore! Ah! Oh, that's one prehistoric parrot! Just how much room was under that desk? Uh, I'm on it! Ah! <sighs> Phew, nice going, Earl. Um, can you point me to the washroom before I use my pants due to terror? Good idea. Let's take a break to look for prehistoric porta potties and figure out how to stay alive. So don't go away, Dilly Dallies, because we've got more quizzing, I hope. Coming up on. Welcome back to Skatoony. Right now, we are five alive with Tyler, David, Ezekiel, me, and the Yarl. Yeah! Dinosaurs or no dinosaurs, the show must go on. So let's play... Draw what you hear and shout out when you know what you call. <laughs> Let me run through the rules. I'm going to read out some instructions for you to follow. Just draw exactly what I tell you. Then bash your buzzer when you think you know what it is you're drawing. Each correct guess gets a point. If you buzz and get it wrong, just keep trying until you think of another guess. The two top scores go through, but the lowest score goes straight home. If we can get home. You have as long as it takes to... Uh... Ah! You've got until that giant salivating T-Rex and all his friends realize we're here and decide to come and eat us all. I got my eye on the dinosaurs. And we're off. Start off with a big round circle. Draw two pointy triangles sticking up from the top of the circle. Ezekiel? Is it a cat? No. Oh, sorry. It is a cat. No. Now add two little rectangles sticking down from the circle's bottom corners. Draw a much smaller circle in the middle of the first. Then draw two dots inside the smaller circle. David, let's see what you got. An alarm clock? Nope, not an alarm clock. Tyler? A pig? Good work. One point to you. They've seen us yet, Earl? Nope. Silly dinosaurs. Shh. Okay. Draw a circle. On one side of the circle, draw a triangle with only one point touching the circle. On the other side of the circle, draw a mouth and an eye. David? A fish. Yes, it is a fish. One point to you. Uh, show me that drawing again. Hmm. There's something fishy about that fish. Okay, next. Draw a small heart at the bottom of the page. Then draw a long straight line from the bottom of the heart up the page towards the top. Tyler? An arrow? Nope, not an arrow. Good guess, though. Now, at the very top of the line, draw a big circle. David? A searchlight with a heart on it. Like, we you know those big searchlights where they have that big circle thing and it shoots into the sky. Like... Batman or something, and that's a heart. Now that is what I call using your imagination. It's not correct, but way to blow my mind, David. Finally, draw teardrop shapes coming off the circle all the way around it. Tyler? A sunflower? Well, a sunflower is a flower, so you got it. One point to you. How we doing, Earl? Over here, you big dumb lizard. Huh? Earl! What are you doing? Sorry. All right. Pens ready, everybody. Draw a circle. Put some beady little eyes on the circle and some nasty fangs below them. David. Cat? 
No, not a cat. Draw a long, sharply bent leg on each side of the body. Save it again. A spider. It is a spider. Super sketching, David. Ding, ding. Round's over, Chad. I don't know how, but they've spotted us. <gasps> oh, well. Well, that's it. Pins and pads down as I tell you that Tyler and David are through. Uh. Well, I'll just wait here until we get back to the future. Yeah. 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 It's wet. Oh, they're going to ruin the quiz. And eat us. Yeah, yeah, that too. So what are we going to do? I guess you got to distract them away from the quizzing kids. What? But, but, but how am I supposed to do that? You could dress up like a dinosaur. I can't do that. I don't even have a dinosaur costume. Pink, but I'm an autumn. Pink just washes me out. Well, that's the end of round two. But only one of our quizzes will have the chance to be this week's Gatuni champion. Up next is the final frantic quiz off between Tyler and David. Yeah, and? Oh, and I go on a blind date with a dozen dinosaurs. So, we'll be right back with more quizzes. <laughs>